Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to a brand new video today with me little lizard and we are here for a bonus video Guys, that's right. This is not the daily crazy craft episode There will also be a sorry witch There will also be another episode a little bit later with myself and scuba Steve But I wanted to get in I was just so excited to do a little bonus episode for you guys And I hope you guys are excited about this as well And if you are be sure to leave a little thumbs up on the video guys Let me know if you want to see this every now and then because I thought it'd be a cool idea to get in and do a little bit of work just around the area. I mean, when myself and Scuba Steve are here, we like to go on some crazy adventures, kill some big mobs, go to new dimensions, but it leaves less time to develop our lovely home. And we do want to work on it. We want to build a zoo. We want our duplicator tree area. I thought you died, Spider. Are you just coming back for more? Why? Oh, I'm hitting him with coal. I was like, why isn't my nightmare sword doing anything? I was trying to... Oh, it was Flint. I was trying to fight him with Flint. But anyway, guys, like I said, if you're excited, be sure to leave a thumbs up. But I suppose, guys, it is time to get in and figure out what we're going to do. Now, I have a little plan. What I really want to do is I want to work out the duplicator tree islands out here. I want to figure out what we're going to do with that because I just think it's going to look so cool, especially from up in our treehouse. And then we also need to extend out a few different areas of the treehouse. Now, we obviously won't get this all done in one go, but it can be a little project, a little secret project of ours. And Scoop Steve can come in and see all the progress we made. I think that would be pretty epic. So let me just jump on up here. I'm going to head up to the chests and see what kind of supplies we have that we could use in order to extend here. Now, let me put some of this away. We've got more slime balls and this. Now, we definitely need a duct tape, guys. As we learned... In the previous episode, the Krakens managed to do a lot of damage to our armor. If you take a look, guys, here's Wolverine's armor. And, I mean, this was after pretty much one fight. Like, look at that chest piece. That's, like, half gone. That's really dangerous, guys. We cannot break those. They're so difficult to make. If we turn around and break our armor in, like, the first fight, then, oh, we'll be in we'll be in a little bit of trouble. So, we shouldn't, definitely shouldn't do that. So, let me put these... Spawn eggs away. We've got some nice ores. Uh, that's titanium. That's that anti-green block. That's pretty cool. I'm just going to put it in there for now. Um, I don't want to waste too much time up here. I want to try just... Let's put the slime balls away. Do, 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 do. Golden leggings. What are you even doing? Let's just put you in there. Some gold ore. And we've got our food. All right. So food-wise, let's grab some of these delicious lamb chops because we need to heal up. And I think what we'll do, guys, while we're building, we'll definitely use the Wolverine armor. But I'm going to go down and I'm going to use the duct tape first. Um, because I just don't want to take any chances with it. And if, let's say, a sea serpent or a water dragon want to come and have a fight, at least we can defend ourselves. So let's see. And... Oh, no. Sorry. I didn't mean to put that on. Uh, we need to just keep eating up this cake. This delicious rubber cake. Uh, like this. So this, guys, if you don't know, this is duct tape, and this helps us repair our armor. Um, so I... Mm, yeah, I need to go. All right. Let, now that we can move fast, let's just run up and grab another duct tape, because I feel like we're going to use it quite a lot. And I don't want to not have any there, just in case, like, we can get some duplicating by the end of the episode. That will be pretty handy. And, guys, what I'm going to do is make this little special bonus video an hour long for you guys. That's right. One full hour. I hope you guys are excited about that. So, what am I looking for? We are looking for some slime ball and some string. And, oh, that's Scuba Steve's girlfriend. We can't get caught talking to her. Scuba Steve will think we're up to no good. Um, so we've got our own girlfriend just over here. Oh, how funny would it be? Okay, we have to do this, guys. Because Scuba Steve has a thing about the girlfriends. It'd be so funny if he came back and I just had, like, an army of girlfriends. And he'd be like, what? where did they come from? I, I could just pretend, like, I don't know. Maybe they just heard of Little Lizard and they all wanted to come meet me. <laughs> Scuba Steve would be so jealous. So we definitely have to do that before we finish up. But, um... Let's... Oh, we didn't get any blocks. Okay, we're going to have to go back up. <laughs> right, we need to start planning and be prepared here. I'm up and down this tree like a yo-yo. Luckily, we can move nice and fast, though. So let's grab... I think we should grab maybe wood. Uh, we have a lot of nice blocks. I'm just not sure what we want to use. Probably jungle wood, guys. Jungle wood seems to be the easiest. 
um, to get because, I mean, we are in a jungle. So what if we can make a chainsaw as well? Uh, how do we, can we make these? Oh, we need the ultimate axe. Oh, that makes things a bit more difficult. But hold on. If we could do this. Let's see. There's a titanium nugget. Let's go searching for all of our titanium and uranium. We've got nuggets. I know Scuba Steve also did get... Check it out. We've got... He got a lot of blocks from a lucky block. Where did he put them? Uh, that's adamantium. Mosquito plant. Okay, there they are. No. What? Where is it? It's here somewhere. I know it. Okay, it's hiding on us. Let me quickly fly through these. All right, we're looking for... I thought it was... It is the one... Yeah, it's this one. It's titanium. Uh, which one is it in? Titanium! Okay, he thought it looked like diamond, so maybe put it in here. Block of diamond. Block of titanium! There we go. There's our uranium, guys. We don't have a lot of uranium nuggets. Ah, uh, we just need one ingot of uranium, and we can make a chainsaw. Anything else? Is it? Was it put anywhere else, I wonder? Mm, no, okay. Well, that would have been really good, but definitely what we'll do is keep them off to the side. Uh, oh, what am I doing? No, give me that back. Um, we keep those off to the side because if we can create a chainsaw, that would be just amazing. And we need redstone as well, so let's put the redstone off to the side. There's a lot of redstone. We've got plenty of that. So there we go. That is for a chainsaw. That's our chainsaw chest. We just need to make the ultimate axe. We've got... Oh, iron ingots. Let's put those in there as well, then. We'll take one stack of iron ingots, please, and stick them on in there. Now, what we could do is try get some uranium, but I mean, I don't know what the best way to do that is. We'll make some lucky blocks. Now, for now, what we'll do is just use an axe. Like I said, I don't want to go too far ahead without Scuba Steve, so we'll just use an axe. Is this a... That's a dark matter axe. Ooh. Let's just make a diamond axe, guys. And we will chop down some of these trees, grab some wood... And start extending our area. And uh, if we grab this, like this, boom, boom, boom. We got it. All right. So there we go. Let's go chop down a tree. Now, I don't know which one I want to chop. Hmm. I don't want to ruin how the forest or, or the jungle looks. I mean, I think it's really cool that we're building in the jungle. So what if I take down, like, this tree? This one looks like a delicious tree for me. I don't think I'll need too much, guys, because what I'm going to do is break it down into planks anyway. So each one of these is going to give me four planks in order to build out for our trees. And we're going to get a lot of them. So let's take a look. There's 21. So, I mean, we've already got 64 and 20. Let's get a little bit more. Uh, there's a, oh, we could just take down a big... No, but there's no point in taking down a big tree until we get our chainsaw, guys. The chainsaw is what we're going to use to clear out our area for our beautiful zoo. And once we get the zookeeper shards. Speaking of which, I think we might do that in the next episode, guys. We'll definitely head to the Rainbow Ant Dimension. So be sure to check out for that. If you guys are watching this as it's released, there will be another episode out later tonight. If you're watching it later on, then it's just the next episode anyway. So you will find it nice and easy. All right. We've got enough of that now. Let's just run and jump. Oh, I love Wolverine because he doesn't even take fall damage. I don't need to go into the water. I could just fall on the ground. Can we jump two bucks? Ooh. Oh, we can climb the walls as well. All right, let's see. Oh, adamantium is spawning. It seems to work very well down here. It's a lot slower up in these areas. It's dropping apples anyway. I don't know. But either way, we're going to extend it out. It's going to be lovely. And, oh, hopefully... Hopefully it works on the ground we're talking. I mean, I, I replaced this to grass and it worked. It didn't like that it was duplicating the sand. But hopefully it works for what we're looking for here. All right, let's make a quick crafting bench down here because we're going to need one. Um, let's bring it on down to the side and let us make a diamond shovel. There we go. And we're going to have to get some dirt in order to plant these trees. So if we just take a load of this... Right here. Is that jungle wood as well? I may as well take it. Come here, jungle wood. Thanking you. So that replaces our crafting bench. And yeah, we're going to need a lot of these. So we may as well grab a little bit more. There we go. This adamantium is just duplicating really fast. Ooh, we could also work on little um, surprise presents for Scuba Steve. I just one hit him. I thought that was going to be a big battle. I completely forgot I was wearing my lovely Wolverine armor. I just won't hit the sea serpent. 
Oh, it's so good, guys. We're so still only getting used to having this armor because last episode is when we managed to complete it. So it is a, it's pretty amazing. All right, let's move the dirt out. Let's move these coffee beans out and let's grab these beautiful things. Now, what we're going to do is... Oh, oh, maybe it's... Okay, you're jumping too high, Wolverine. Here we go. That's better. Let's just float a little bit. Sometimes it's too good. All right, so this is what I'm thinking, guys. We need to extend out like this and go out. Maybe three and five like this. I don't know if this is good. Let's see. Let's see what kind of size this gives us. We're definitely going to need a lot more wood. But if we can get a nice system in place first. Uh, let's bring it in like this. Down like this. Uh, yeah, that looks pretty good. And then what we'll do is we'll put dirt in the middle. Like so. Now we have to obviously test if this is going to work, guys. This might be a bit of a bit of a mistake. So the first thing we're going to do is test it. So let's grab a little bit of duplicator tree. We're going to have to make it grow pretty fast. I think the duplicator tree will grow. I'm just thinking whether the blocks will duplicate. So we can let's take this as our test run before we continue on and making it too big. That was a creeper explosion, I'm pretty sure. Let's take one of these adamantium blocks and we'll stick it out beside it. And hopefully the tree will grow and the adamantium will duplicate. But there we go. That's ready there now. So what we also have to do is Go and get... Oh, there's a wasp. We need to get some more girlfriends, but I think we'll we'll wait till later because I want to see if this can duplicate first. Oh, there's going to be a war. I can, I can see you going for that. These, I think these creatures like fighting each other more than they like fighting us. Who's going to win, guys? Quickly, in the comments, Water Dragon or Sea Viper? Who have you got your money on? I'm going to say Sea Viper is going to win. Let's see, let's see. Who else agreed with me? Sea Viper or Water Dragon? Oh, it's a battle to the death. No, Water Dragon. I'm going to save you. Oh, oh, quickly put on the boots. Oh, I threw the sword away. No, 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 Sea Viper. I'm going to punch you to death. It's me and the Water Dragon. We're friends now. No, you killed my friend. Oh, oh this is what Guys, is that an ultimate pickaxe? No. I was only having fun. I just got an ultimate pickaxe drop. Yes, that's so cool. Oh, that is so amazing. I was not expecting that at all. Check it out. We got the ultimate pickaxe. Efficiency 5, fortune 5. The diamond pickaxe. Oh, let's... Oh, there. Okay, yes. Duplicator tree is growing. Everything is just working in our favor right now, guys. Let's get rid of a few of those. And uh, copy beans, peanut, let's throw that away. Sticks, okay. Water dragon scale will keep, sea viper tongue will keep because, I mean, those are supplies that we will need eventually. It seems like these have issues right here. Are they too close together? I mean, this one seems to just go much faster and it's a bit further away. Hmm. I don't know, but at least these will be spread out. But guys, I got this amazing pickaxe. I'm so happy about it. Um,. I also want your suggestions. So if I'm doing a few bonus videos here and there, guys, I would like to work on a gift armor suit for Scuba Steve. So what we're going to do is we're going to create a little um, secret area. A secret area. Are there secret blocks in this? Let's find out. Oh, yes. This is amazing. Okay, so what we're going to do need is a secret trap door. We need to make some camouflage paste. Ooh, I think this means I can just put anything around dirt. Are you, are you trying to fight me? Seems like a bad idea. These ants, I think, are like the biggest problem here. <laughs> All right, so let's make a secret uh, trap door, guys, in the jungle. And we'll have to mark it somewhere. Oh, there's a big hole there. And we'll mark it somewhere. And this is where we're going to store a secret chest. And in that chest, we are going to be working on supplies for a gift for Scuba Steve. And I think it should be Iron Man. Let me know, guys, if you agree. Hashtag Iron Man if you think that's a good one for Scuba Steve to take. And I would like to work on an Iron Man suit for him to have. Um, because I know he would love that. He loves Iron Man. It's one of his favorites, if not his all-time favorite. And I think he'd really appreciate it. So, let's see if we can do this. Uh, will this work if I just completely surround some dirt? Yes! We got a nice amount of camouflage placed. Paste. Paste. <laughs> okay, so secret trap door. We just need a trapdoor for that, which is just a load of wood. Let's make one of those. There's some trapdoors. Can we just throw a little bit of... Oh, no. It has to be a regular trapdoor. Ah, okay. 
I did not take out that portal gun. I don't know what happened there. Okay, let's throw... Uh, jungle wood planks. Let's put you back in for a second. I mean, do you know what? Let's just use one of our backpacks. Oh, also, I did. You guys are probably say, shouting at your screens. I forgot to put the duct tape down. I'm going to go do that now as well. We've loads going on. I was surprised. I was getting in this and I was thinking, oh, it'll be nice and relaxing. It's just me. We'll chill out. We'll get a little bit of stuff done. But whoa, I'm after taking a lot of, uh, a lot of stuff on here. And it's going to take a little bit of time. But I like it. I love a challenge of getting some new stuff done. So which way is it? There we go. There's two trap doors. Hopefully this works now. Yes. Okay, we've got a secret trap door. Um, what about a secret chest? Can we make a secret chest? We surely can. Uh, we need to put camouflage paste, rotten flesh. Okay, that's a weird one, but hopefully we... I definitely think we have rotten flesh somewhere. I mean, it's something we just throw in. Sometimes we throw it away, though. Oh, we've only got two in there. Hmm. I need four. Please tell me we have two rotten flesh somewhere in here. Scuba Steve, please tell me you messed up and put them in here somewhere. Let's put those in there. Um, rotten flesh, rotten... F Ooh, what about our backpack? No, what about our other backpack? Um, no, we throw away all the rotten flesh. I mean, who thinks they need rotten flesh? No one ever thinks... Oh, wait, in here? Is there any? Please? I can't see any. Am I going blind? Oh, no. No rotten flesh. All right. What we can't do is use wool. I just, I prefer not use wool, guys, because wool is good for the superhero armors. But let's do it anyway. Here we go. Uh, we don't have a chest yet, so let's quickly make that. Boom, boom. Chest in the middle. Camouflage paste all around. And then, of course, let's throw in these beautiful lime green dyes. Okay, so we have our secret trapdoor, our secret chest. What we need now is a few ladders, because if we're going underground, we are going to need ladders. And let's just quickly make a lot of sticks, like so. And let's make... I don't want to go too deep, because then we're just getting into, like, although, a cool secret underground lair. Oh, that would be so cool. Oh, it'd be really cool. Okay, let's just go do this. Now, we need to find somewhere that Scuba Steve can't find. So, I'm thinking... I think it's somewhere right close to the base as well. Would be pretty cool. What about in here somewhere? Hmm. I think it doesn't really matter where it is. Because it's going to be a secret, it's going to... Once it blends in, I think we're good. I mean, this kind of... Oh, yeah. Well, that's... That's not going to be noticeable. Especially if I... Oh, no, no, no. I don't want to dig there. Okay, we'll keep that one. But let's dig straight... Oh, okay. Oh, we get to test out our brand new pickaxe. Watch this, guys. Ready? Oh, it's just so much faster. Look how beautiful it is. Woo! Oh. I can't jump that high. <laughs> okay. Um, mm, have we gone a bit low? What if we just do this? Okay. Let's... We're going to build up. Get ourselves out of here. We've got a little bit low. Excuse me. Can I jump up? Oh, I can climb walls! I'm Wolverine! I forgot! Oh, it's the best feeling ever. Okay. And I don't take fall damage. So let's just fill all this in again. Um, let's go over here. Let's do that. And then we could just... Can I just kind of shift on these walls like it's ladder? No, I can't. Okay. What I, what I can do is maybe bounce on it. Give me a stone! I just want to fill these walls in so that... Yay, there we go. So it looks normal. Right, let's climb up. Come on, Wolverine. Do I need to have nothing in my hands? Wolverine. Okay, there we go. Climb. All right, so this is what it's going to look like, guys. So let's grab our secret trap door. Oh, I think that looks pretty pretty good. I mean, I know it's stone. Uh, I know, I like it. Do you know what? I like it. Okay, let's do that. And once we get in, we're going to have to do ladders. I don't know if I want to go this deep, but do you know what? It's not a big problem. Deep is fine. And there we go. So can we... Yeah, that'll be perfect. Okay, let's go in. Let's close our door. Cl close, close the trap door. Oh, this is our brand new secret base, guys. All right. So we want to make it look cool. But it's going to take some time and a bit of work. Because we don't have the coolest of blocks just yet. But I mean, if we make this look like a huge underground lab that we are working on, a secret superhero armor, 
Ah, oh, how, how could that not be cool, guys? I think that would be amazing. And that's why I love doing these, like, little bonus episodes every now and then. This isn't something I could ever do if Scuba Steve was here, because he'd know. Guys, then I couldn't work on a secret project for him if he knew all about it. And that's no good. So let's just take these out. Uh, we've got one, two, three, four blocks this way, so let's do the same that way. Hopefully, Scuba Steve's never in a mine, and he uses, like... A miner's dream and just run straight into this because that would be so sad. Imagine a miner's dream went straight through my secret area. Oh no, I don't even want to think about that. So I'm not. I'm not going to think about it. I'm just going to work at this. And also, guys, I forgot to mention and I will show Scuba Steve later. I added in the maps because you guys were saying a map would be really good to have and we could set a waypoint at home. So here is Ray's mini map up in the top right corner looks much better and what we can do then is at least we can see coordinates of cool things and we can remember where they are and we can also set a nice waypoint for our home area and right, let me just mine this uh, put it in there okay so this is going to be the beginning of the secret lab now i think the biggest thing is to make it go down and look epic so what we're going to do is like a staircase around like this um so that's all going to have to be mined out okay let's just get it's just so much faster with this. I love this. I can't believe I found it. It's so good. All right, let's just mine all these out at the side. And this, 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 this. Here we go. And let's get all of these out cleared. I think it's going to look really cool if we come down into like a staircase and it opens up into a really cool lab. Now, guys, I need your help. This has to be kept a really big secret. Can you guys keep a secret with me? Because I think it will be... It's not like it's a bad secret. It's a good secret. So it's not a bad thing if we don't tell Scuba Steve. He's going to be excited in the future when we show him when it's done. But it has to be when it's done, guys. Um, so I need your help with that. Only you guys can keep this secret. Okay. Oh, my duct tape! <laughs> I'm so sorry. I forgot all about it. <laughs> Alright, at least we can check on our new area as well. Once we get up here like this and big jumps where okay yeah we're over here i was like where is the home where is home it is lost all right here we go so we need to get over there and place the duct tape down and see if that tree is grown anymore i might be a little bit out of range for it to grow uh, we might have to kind of hang around this area a little bit more but we'll find out let's see oh okay it's fully grown that's a good sign but will this duplicate Hmm, I don't know. First of all, it's kind of looking like this platform isn't big enough. And does it need to be on grass? Oh, come on. Take the boots off. So Wolverine's not a good swimmer. We've learned that. Wolverine is a bad swimmer. So how about that? We've got... Okay, we need to do the same on the front then. Hopefully that is enough of an area. Now, will it duplicate on this ground? It's just... It's a mystery, guys. We need to solve it. And we will solve it. I wouldn't do it, Sea Viper. Your friend would advise you against it. Yeah. Ah, uh, that's what happens if you come at me when I've got the Nightmare Sword and the Wolverine Armor. Okay, but anyway. Let's take a little look around here. Yeah, these are still duplicating nicely down here. There's nothing on this one because we came out to put the duplicator or the duct tape on it. Uh, like that. Alright, hopefully that works now. If not, we will definitely get this um, out at sea working. Even if we have to change that to grass or dirt, mm, we could do that as well. Okay, is this like a silk touch? I would like if it was. No. It'd be really cool if we could get a silk touch um, tool. Because I just, I'd, I'd prefer to be able to pick up grass rather than have to try and make it grow out there. Because then you have to connect a lot of dirt together and it's just no fun. So let's see if we can find our little trap area as we're going here um it might be difficult hopefully not let's see okay there it is yes this is good for us guys we can spot it easy but it's still not that noticeable and uh, let's go down okay we got to remember to always keep the door closed otherwise we will definitely get found out so this is what i'm thinking guys check it out this is the kind of way oh no 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 not like that oh i think we were one two yes we are okay you guys probably noticed that. I didn't notice. But we need to go one more on this side. I am talking too much. I didn't plan it out right. But once we take down this wall, we'll have a nice little format going. Do, 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 do. There we go. 
And same with all that. Let's take out this dirt block. So, you'll kind of get be able to see what I'm talking about. If we keep going down the levels, we're going to have to also make go further into the ground. We're making this pretty big, guys. This is going to be the underground Iron Man lab, which means we will store all the Iron Man suits down here. Because once I show Scuba Steve, we can both work in here together. But I just want to give it to him as a, a surprise at the start. And again, we're going to have to go out. We're going to have to go further back. It's going to look really cool. I can pi just picture a huge underground lab, guys. And do you know what? If you guys would like to build your very own underground lab, and then, guys, if you follow me on Instagram, you could tag me in pictures of your lab, and I will take inspiration from those, because I want to see what you guys can build as well. Because um, you guys are watching me build, but I want to see some stuff you guys do. So, if you want, guys, be sure to check the description. You can follow my Instagram there, and you can send pictures of your very own labs underground, and I will take a look at them. And you guys will know that I've seen them because I like any of the pictures I see on Instagram. And you guys will know that I have seen them. And I will use parts of your labs in here. Which would be pretty cool. So be sure to do that down below in the description. But for now, we're going to start on the basics. And the basics is always a little bit boring. It's a little bit of like shaping the rooms. Um, which, it can get a little bit tedious. But I mean, if we start small... Then get a little bit of um, gear for it. Then keep going, keep going. Like that. I mean, that's a small start. But you can kind of see if you come down, it starts to, like, you come down the steps and down the steps. And we keep going down the steps. It's going to open up into a huge, really cool, really, really cool room full of Iron Man suits. And we have to just make it look really, like, technical. Because, I mean, if you think about Iron Man's labs... They, they look real futuristic and cool. And, I mean, I feel like that's what we kind of do. We kind of got to do that as well. So, let's just take out this floor. And then I'm going to stop the mining for now. And what we could do is... Uh, we can start looking at what kind of supplies we need. I know we need a Stark's workbench. And I got it. Oh, did I just get a... I just got a, like a little uranium nugget out of that. Let me just grab this backpack. Oh, uh, oh. Let's throw that away. Open this up. Stick a few of these in. These backpacks are the best thing ever. I actually need to go on a hunt to get some more. But the only thing is I feel like I'll fill them all up. And then I'll just like have 20 backpacks full of stuff. And I won't ever empty them. Which wouldn't be good. But check it out. All right. We come down. We go do 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 do. But if, imagine these walls going like another 20 blocks back. Another 30 blocks back. And 20 blocks. And going down and down and down. It's going to be cool. But it's a good start. So let's put down our secret chest for now. Because this is going to be our supply chest. Oh, look at it. I mean, even if Scuba Steve found this, he'd just be like, ah, it's just a room. But check it out. We're going to have secret supplies in here. It's going to be good. Right, so let's get out for now. I want to get some more quartz, guys. Quartz is going to be probably the base of the, the area. I mean, quartz is just going to look good. That's a rainbow ant. Oh, does that mean our, our rainbow ant nest around here is working? Where is it? It's down here somewhere. But that's where we want to go in the next episode, guys. So hopefully we can find them easy. Oh, guys. Yes. Look. It's working. It's beautiful. Oh, yes. This is it. Check it out. Okay. It just needed enough space, it seems. And now it is beautiful, which means we are going to go to town on this. We got, a, we got a lot of extending to do. Oh, that's perfect timing. Okay. One, two... All right, what is it? Let's count. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six blocks out. And then we'll do another one. So let's go again. This is this is going to look so cool, guys. When we have like a hundred of these. Oh, come on, Iron Man. Or Wolverine, can you not stay on the... Let's shift. There you go. One, two, three, four, five, and six. And then what we're going to do is start extending out a brand new platform. And we can add another tree in. Oh, I jumped off. Okay, hold on. Let's put that one there. And that one there. And that one. Oh, hello. Hold on. I'm... Ah! <laughs> Guys, if you didn't know, I may be good at some things in Crazy Craft. I'm not the best at building. Um, but we'll get there eventually. There we go. We got the blocks back. So let's put those down there. I do want to get another tree going. Just if we get... Yeah, we could definitely get a few more of these going, actually. I'm going to go up and grab some more of these jungle wood planks. I think I put some in a chest, did I? 
Did I, did I, did I? Is it not in there? No, maybe I did. Oh, I did. Okay, there we go. Well, let's use these before we go. And what we'll do is take some more duplicator trees. Do I need to go out another block here? I think I do. Boom. Yeah, that's right. And let's extend across here. How many do we have to go in? We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven blocks. Okay. That's three. Up. Okay. We're in the... Oh, come on, Wolverine. <laughs> ah, take that off. Okay. You're not getting your shoes back, Wolverine, until you stop... Until you learn how to swim. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. For the record, I don't think I'd ever try to take Wolverine's shoes off him in real life. He's a, he's pretty scary. Uh, but in this, they're my shoes now. Simples. Okay, guys, let's go grab some more jungle wood. This is looking good. We need to place a dirt block in the middle there. So, yeah, well, we may as well grab the wood first. And we've got some cobblestone, stuff like that. But check it out. Look at the amount of adamantium we've got, guys. What do we need more than adamantium? I'm thinking we need the uranium and titanium. But I kind of like the idea of trying to get some of that ourselves first. I don't want to make it too easy. I think this needs to be extended, guys. You know that? I think we might need to just do another layer out here. Will that help it, do you think? I mean, that would be interesting to know. If this starts suddenly duplicating a lot faster... Did I... Okay, guys, I'm going crazy. Oh, wait, hold on. I think I saw it. There! My time and shovel. Well, how did that get in there? All right, here we go. Let's grab some more of this um, grass here. Just like so. And let's just put it along here. I just want to double check and see if it's space is the issue with this. Because like I said, it's working perfect down there. And it doesn't seem to have the same effect up here. But it's even better that it's down there because I don't think we're actually going to use them up here. We'll more than likely just keep them all down there. We might set up a cool storage area up here. But for now, just while it's working away, um, let's just do that and see if it makes a difference to this area. I mean, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, now it's the same size as those. And if it starts working, then we know space is the issue, nothing else. Because, it, yeah, this doesn't have a lot of space here. Let's do this. See if it helps. Okay. So let's head on into the jungle. Is this a jungle tree? It is. But do we like it? No. Yeah, we do. Let's keep it there for a minute. And let's head over to the jungle. Somewhere that we're not going to use too much. Um, and we're not going to waste like nice areas. Because obviously if we're living in the jungle, we want it to look good. And we're going to make some lovely tree houses. So, what about this tree? Is this tree going to get used? I don't think so, but it's a bit big to be taken down, I think. Um, here's two nice little ones. Let's take these. Excuse me, trees. I need your wood. Oh, Wolverine's too fast. Here we go. Let's grab all of this. Wow, he's got a good reach on him as well. Um, let's put one down just for... Just to get up nice and high. I thought that was the last one, so we may as well. Is that a... It's a ravine. There's a girl. Oh, that reminds me. We need to get more girlfriends. Guys, this is a pretty cool ravine. I'm not even sure we've spotted this. Scuba Steve might have because he seems to adventure a little bit. Whoa, what's going on? Wolverine, you nearly threw me off the side. I keep blaming Wolverine as if he's here doing this to me. It's definitely me just wearing his armor. But, I mean, if we can blame someone else, let's do it. All right, let's take a look. Don't actually do that, guys. Uh, but let's take a look at what kind of wood we got here. 16. It's not a lot. I mean, we saw how quick that goes. We're going to have to chop down a couple more trees here. Uh, what about... Are there any more... Hello? Oh, elephant grass everywhere. Any more? Are these... These aren't jungle trees. Okay, here's one. Give me, give me, give me, give me all your wood. Okay, chainsaws are going to be really cool, guys. I can't wait. They're just going to be so much fun. Is that jungle wood? Yeah. Do... Because, guys, if you don't know what a chainsaw does, it pretty much does what it says on the tin. I mean, it is going to take the whole tree out in one go. I mean, forget chopping down bit by bit. The whole tree, in one shot, will be gone. It doesn't matter how big it is. It's literally going to be torn down. That's leaves, that's wood, that's everything. But it all lands at your feet, so you get all the supplies, which is amazing. So we're not actually far off making one. And that's how we will clear out our area. Do you know what? I'm going to work with Scuba Steve to try get one in this episode, because if we could do that, 
it will be really good for setting up the zoo, which is something I want to do from the start. I feel like the zoo should grow with us when we get all the spawn eggs, guys. We also need our golden apple cow pen. Now, do we want to do that up in the air? I don't know. It'd be pretty cool if we did. It'd probably be a lot easier just to do on the ground. But you guys can let us know about that as well. But golden apples are going to be needed. Look at this. There's like a war going on over here. If you guys break any of our stuff, crabs, sea vipers, if you break any of my blocks, I'll be very upset. I'm trying to work over here now. You leave me alone. You go away, very large crab. Uh, sea viper, crab. The sea vipers are mean, aren't they, crab? Huh? They poison you and everything. But the crab's getting some good hits in here. If it wasn't poisons... You'd have a chance. I feel like the Sea Viper is going to turn on me after this. But so's the. Oh, so's everything. Hey! No. Bold. And you. Go. No! <laughs> okay, fair enough. He got me there. Sea Viper! Leave all the curbs alone. He's only a baby curb. Hey, come here. Come here. Why are you being so. Oh. I can't wait. I'm going to have my own very, my very own pet Sea Viper, guys. In a little lake in our zoo. That's what we're going to do. And if you guys didn't know, we can actually do that. It's going to be a lot of fun. And actually, will they attack us? I'm not sure. <laughs> Hopefully not, but they won't despawn. That's all I know. Um, but it's been a while, so I can't remember if they're going to attack us or not. I would like to think my own sea viper would be kind to me and let me sit on its back and tickle its belly. But I have a feeling it would instead try to bite me and eat me. But we'll see. We'll find out because we're going to try it anyway. Okay, let's grab some dirt. Do we have some dirt? Thank you. Let's put it in the middle there. I think that's where it goes. One, two, three. One, one, two, three. Yeah. All right. So let's grab just a block from here. It's so good that you just need to take a block from a different tree. Set it down. Let it start duplicating. So let's go for the next one. I think we should continue out one more. And then what we'll do is we'll, we'll start going sideways and kind of work with it that way. All right, so we need to go one, two, three, four, five, six, and there we go. There's the seven. Let's go out one, two, three. Yep. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. All right, we've got the system down now. We know how to make a square. All is good. We're learning. And uh, like this. Okay. And I think we turn back in here. Four, five. Ooh, that seems wrong. Oh, no, that's the seven. Is it? Is it? Did I do it wrong after all my talking? I hope I did it right. Let's find out. Do we have enough blocks? Mm, oh, we've got loads. Nice. Uh, do we put it here? No, we put it here. Okay. It seems right. Oh, tell me it's right. I think it's right. Let's put this in here. Boom. And what we might do eventually, guys, is make these bridges a bit longer. Like, look at this. It's already grown up so fast. Oh, I'm so proud. All right. Let me grab the duplicator tree wood, put it in there. Now what we'll do is we'll start on our this way. One, two, three, four, five, and six. And there we go. Seven. So there's one, two. Oh, we need the last stack. Okay, I think we'll only get one more of these done. But, I mean, it's a great start to our duplicator tree farm. We could make as many of these as we want, guys. Which is just going to be crazy good. Oh, hold on. Did I go too far that way now? I think I was counting the wrong way. Okay, let's count. I guess it should go seven as well. If it's a perfect square. Yes, it is. It is a perfect square. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. And we need one more. Seven, let's turn, one, two, three, four, five. Look at me, I can count, I can build, I'm doing really good. Let's get these down. All right, so now we need to decide, guys, what blocks we want to actually start duplicating. We know these ones work perfectly, so what do we need? What 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 do we need the most? Oh, we should definitely work on something that... Mm, now I'm thinking, do I need my own duplicator tree in my secret area? I think I do, guys, because if I'm duplicating stuff for the likes of an Iron Man... It, ooh, oh, I don't have the boots on. I was like, how did the Creeper survive that? Um, if I'm going to duplicate my own stuff for Scuba Steve, I don't want them to see what I'm duplicating. I mean, if, if we're out here duplicating so much titanium, he'd be like, well, why are you doing that? We, we don't need that. 
So what I'm going to do is grab a block here. We're going to go make one in our secret area. Now, guys, as I said, do not tell Scoop Steve about this. <laughs> well, just try not to. Um, hopefully, even if he finds out, he won't be able to find it. That's the idea with a secret area. It needs to be secret. It needs to be secure. So let's go down, and we're going to place one in there. We're going to take a look at, then, the Iron Man outfit and what kind of materials we're needing. I'm pretty sure, guys, we need a lot of titanium. Um, from what I remember, titanium is key. And titanium is king. Okay, so we obviously have night vision. We do. I was wondering because I was like, why is it so bright down here? And then I realized if I took these off, it gets pretty dark. Okay, so we'll need to get some torches and some lights in here. But for now, looks pretty good. And what we want to do is let's take this one out. Let's just mine back maybe four blocks just to extend it slightly. Because what we'll need to do is make space. Now, will the duplicator tree grow underground? We're learning a lot of things today, guys. We're doing a lot of myth busting. You guys will now know the answer. Because I don't know the answer. And if you guys do, then you guys know more than me. But I don't know. So what we're going to do is find out. And if we place it on a nice bit of dirt, what we'll do is maybe change the ground. Have I got... Yeah, I've got definitely gone too far here, have I? Maybe not, actually. Maybe it's right here. May oh, it was perfect. I shouldn't have questioned myself. All right. So what we'll do is maybe change the ground just to cobblestone around it just so we can see exactly the square that it needs and just hope, hope that it all works. What am I getting out of this? I'm getting some nice little supplies. This must be the efficiency. No, not the efficiency. What is on it? Um, the fortune. That's the one. The fortune on the pickaxe is giving me these little gems. And I mean, if we went on a big mining spree, you could get a lot of these little titanium and uranium nuggets. That would be so good. Enough to make an ingot, actually. Then we can make a chainsaw. Uh-oh. There's sand. Hopefully we don't come out into an area and have to worry about not being low enough. I mean, we mined down quite a lot. But we did kind of start on the side of a hill. So that's my only other worry. Um, we'll find out, though. Okay, here we go. Let's take these out. Do, 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 do. Once we have these, duplicator trees will begin. Actually, do you know what? Duplicator trees could look really cool underground. And they would kind of look a little bit sciencey if they had all the blocks around them. So we could make like a... Um, it's almost like a plant research section of our lab. That would be pretty cool. We could make it look really cool with like different color vines or... I don't know, just mad kind of foresty items in it. And then duplicator trees creating and growing this organic material for us to make Iron Man suits. Now, I know Iron Man suits, you don't need organic material. But it would be cool nonetheless. Do -do -do. No, I need that one. Let's just get rid of some of that. And let's hoover all of this up. All right. So we've extended it back a little bit. So now what we'll do is just make a little section... And uh, let's just make it directly in front. Well, no, let's make it to the side a bit. So we want one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, yeah, let's mine it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it's actually a bigger square than it looks outside. It takes up a lot of this room. I mean, it just goes to show how small our room is right now. But hopefully it's the right size, is it? It looks so much bigger in here, guys. Is, is that just me? I don't know. But anyway, let's grab 25 of these blocks. Let's just fill it. Okay, that has to be one, two, three, four. No, I can't believe that's the right size. It just seems huge. Okay, it's probably because it's out on the vast ocean that it looks a lot small, smaller because the ocean's so big. And this room is so small, so that makes sense. But let's just fill it in with cobblestone here. And we are going to find out. Where's the, where's the middle one? Uh, one, two, is it this one? One, two, three, this one right here. Give me. Okay, and uh, let's get the dirt. Where's the dirt? We definitely put it away because we weren't thinking. No! Backpack, what are you doing? Come here, thank you. Um, Dirt, let's grab that. All right, so there's our duplicator tree underground. Hopefully it's got the height it needs as well. Will it grow? I don't know, guys. Maybe we need some light down here. I know I can see, but like I said, if I take this off, it's pretty dark, and it doesn't look like a tree should be able to grow in that. So what I might do is just make a couple of torches really quick. 
and then we will come down and put them in there just to light the place up slightly make it look pretty cool and of course we're gonna have to get a lot of quartz so we might start duplicating quartz now quartz is easy to get there's probably no point in doing that um let me just grab some trees and some coal or some um torches there's 36 that's pretty sweet that's nice i wasn't expecting so many so soon Let's throw some of these blocks away. I know it's kind of getting a little bit messy, but we can fix it after. There's no worries there. We've got the torches. We want whatever we're going to duplicate. So, let's take a look at the Iron Man armor. Now, the good thing about, or the fun thing about Iron Man armor, guys, is you need to start from the very first one. So, you need like the, is it this Mark 1? Is that the first one you can do? I think it is. You need like the under shell armor. Um, first, let me have a quick little look. Uh, Iron Man armor, superhero, unlimited. Okay, so let's have a quick look at the crafting recipe, guys. Oh wait, it's, we're just trying to find it here. One second, we need the stack workbench. Ah, yes. So that's the way we create this. So we need stack tech. Okay. Block of diamond, block of iron, crafting bench, two high-tech electronics. We could probably do that, guys. I'm not messing. We could probably get that done. Let's make some electronics real quick first. Let's just see how quick we can go with this. Uh, that's adamantium. There's some titanium. Let's take that. There's a lot of redstone. And in here, we should have a lot of iron. Let's take that. Uh, block of iron. Let's grab that. Okay. High-tech electronics. We need two high-tech electronics, which means we need eight electronics. Which is redstone on the outside, I'm pretty sure, and iron in the middle. I mean, yes, we only need eight of those. So there's four. Let's do this. And four. Oh, look at that. So quick. Okay, so we've got the enough electronics for those. Now what we need, we have the ingots. We need redstone repeaters. We need stone, redstone torches. All right, let's not waste any time. Let's get in. Give me some wood. Thank you. Let's get over here. Let's make some sticks. Boom, boom, boom. We've got the torches. We need cooked stone. I don't think we have cooked stone, do we? Oh, we've so much cooked stone. That's so good. All right. And then finally, what else did we need? We needed... That was it. Okay, let's make two of those, I think, is all we need. So let's do two, two, and two. All right. Now, to be fair, guys, we could make a lot of redstone repeaters because we're going to need a lot in the future. But let's just make these up first. I just want to see if we can get this workbench in and ready to go. Because if we can start crafting these as soon as we want, it's going to be a good day for us. So let's show this together in here. There we go. Two high-tech electronics. Crafting bench. Yep. Here we go. Crafting bench. What else do we need? Two blocks of iron, a block of diamonds. Let's just grab some diamonds. Actually, there's a block right there. Thank you very much. Pre-made block. Um, so we go... Nope. Wait, hold on. Let's do this right. So crafting bench in there, that one in there, and the two high-tech electronics. Oh, the stack workbench. We've got it. That's so cool. Okay, that's a really good start. I mean, out of nowhere, that's crazy good. Let's put these sea viper tongues away and the scale. Let's get some delicious food out because I'm getting hungry. All of this work is just, it's making me hungry. Okay, so Stark Workbench, we can go put that down there. We also need to grab a block that we want to duplicate. So I'm guessing titanium is going to be one that we'll need. So let's just take, I think there's titanium in here. Yep, let's grab one of those. Oh, tungsten. That could be one worth duplicating, guys, because that was hard enough to find, but... For now, we could definitely add that to our farm outside. So Scoobsty will understand why we'd want that farm out there. Why we'd want tungsten. Because we did have to go searching for that a little bit. Oh, no, no, no. We can't do that. That's so obvious. All right, here we go. We're going down. So next time... Oh, it's growing. Yes. Oh, guys. Everything is just working out so perfect here. So let's just throw a few torches up in the corners of the, the room. Just to kind of start bringing this place to life. What have we got? Can we put it up? Oh, is that even? No, it's not. We have to put two up. I need to make sure it's even. Like that. That looks nice. Okay, so let's grab the titanium. Let's chuck it down there. Hopefully it duplicates. Mm, I don't see why not. 
I think it could. And over here, we've got the Stark Workbench. Um, can I use it? Hold on. Did I put it the wrong way around? No, I need something. I need something else, don't I? Stark Tech, Stark Workbench. Uh, okay, so Stark Workbench can be used to craft Iron Man's armor. It will require the player to wear an Iron Man suit to use it. Okay, so we need to get a basic suit in order to use it. Now. Oh, okay. So the firing suits can all be performed in a Stark Workbench. And then the following items can be created in a Stark Workbench. Okay, so I think we can make Iron Man Mark 1. And then when we wear that, we can use this. Before that, we can't. Now, to craft it, we need fifth, or leather armor... 15 iron blocks, 4 magnesium, 2 electronics, 2 rockets, and a mini arc reactor. Okay, so that's going to be a bit of a challenge um, to start going on with. But we could take a look what kind of leather's there. I mean, 15 iron blocks, we know that's easy, guys. We have that pretty much there. Magnesium ingots. I'm not sure we've seen magnesium yet. Um, it's worth trying to have a quick look in here. Oh, that's uranium. Okay, cool. Wait, uranium ore? Does that mean I could create... Magnesium! There's so much of it! Oh, okay, let's go cook some. That's actually pretty cool. Uh, I did not realize we had that, guys. Uh, there's a bit of food. Let's throw those in there. Let's throw some of those in there. Some of those in there. Uh, we've no more coal, do we? Oh, we've got a lot of coal over here. Gimme, 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 gimme. Doo -doo. Like that. And we've got lots of coal down here, so let's take half of those. Put them in there. All right, so we're going to have the magnesium we need. That's easy. Now, we need a mini arc reactor, two rockets, two electronics, 15 iron blocks, and leather armor. It's actually not as difficult as we thought, guys. Oh, it's only giving me nuggets. I was wondering. I was like, if that gives me an ingot, I could make a chainsaw. But no, not just yet. Okay, but, I mean, that's, that's already so much magnesium. I mean, we don't even need that much. We only need four. So I may as well, I'll take it out for now because we don't want to leave any, um, any evidence of what we're trying to do here. So let's just put it back in the chest and we have our beautiful ingots. Let's see if we can grab leather armor and if we can, we can keep it down below. We've got one piece of leather. That's no good. Do we have any more leather hidden around here somewhere in crazy places? I mean, I feel like this chest should have some. No. Okay, so letter's going to be something we need to get. Now, where's the best place to get that? I'm guessing if we take out some cows. I tend to throw away letter and zombie flesh, and we needed both of them in this episode. But it's good to know, because going down the line in the future, we will we will get that and put it together. Okay, so I'm going to take what I have. Uh, we've got the 21 blocks. Okay, we need 15 of those. Let's put six of them back, because I'm not going to notice the difference. All right, so there's 15 blocks of iron. Let's put those back as well. Magnesium, you can go back in there. There's our magnesium. Those are our ingots for our thingy. We need two electronics, two rockets, and a mini-arc reactor. But they're going to take a little bit of time. Definitely a little bit of time. But let's take a look at what a mini-arc reactor needs, guys. A mini-arc... Oh, there it is. That's definitely it. And we can't see the crafting recipe in this. I'm not sure why, but... Okay, to craft it, we need 9 palladium, 4 titanium, and 4 high-tech electronics. Oh, okay. So there's palladium. I knew we had that. So let's take the 9. Again, if we keep it down below, Scuba Steve will never notice it's missing. 4 titanium. Mm, yeah, so let's put 1, 2, 3. So there's that. Okay, actually, hold on. We just need four high-tech electronics now, which isn't difficult. I mean, we've got torches. We've got redstone. Uh, we've got iron. So let's grab some more iron, bring that down with us. And then if we take just... Yep, that should be plenty. Okay, so we're going to stock all of that down below, guys, in our chest. I just don't want anyone finding out that it's not... Um, that it's missing or... We had loads and suddenly it's gone and then suddenly there's questions of where it's gone and like I need to keep this as covert as possible. Oh, I thought I was looking. I thought I could see it. Oh, I was checking to see if it duplicated. Okay, it didn't yet. All right, so here we go. Iron, iron, titanium, magnesium, palladium, redstone, redstone torches. We also need repeaters, isn't it? Redstone repeaters. We need to cook stone. 
Uh, there's uranium. How many? Did we have our uranium here with us? That's gold. Okay, there's more iron. We could put that in there. Definitely. I mean, we're definitely going to need a lot of it. <laughs> iron Man isn't the easiest of superheroes to create. So I've definitely... I've given myself a small challenge, guys. But I like it, so it's going to be fun. So let's just throw that stuff in there. It's all supplies that we're going to need. Uh, there's spawn Kyubis. Okay, let's put those upstairs as well. Uh, two Miners Dream... Black iron. Yeah, we're going to keep those because I know Skip Steve knows we have them. And yeah, I mean, it sounds pretty good. Looks pretty good. And let's go check on our duplicate trees. Okay, so that's enough for the secret base, guys, for today. We're definitely going to keep working on it. If you guys are excited for it, then be sure to let me know in the comments section. Hashtag secret base, but whisper it. <laughs> if you could even do that. I don't, I don't even know how you would do that, but we got to keep it secret. All right, let's see. Did we extend it down here. Has it done anything? No. Why not? Okay, do you know what? I'm going to take one of these. D oh, it just breaks. Oh, no. That's bad. Okay, we're going to have to go make another one and put it out in the new area, which we know will work. It does definitely work. So let's grab some slime balls, some string, stick it out on our brand new area. Uh, slime balls. Where did I put them? In here? Mm, I put them somewhere. Oh, I think I have them in my chest or in my backpack. There we go. There's seven. We definitely have string. Where did I put the string? It's not in here. Is it in... Ooh, let's just get rid of some of this. Is it in this one? String. Nice. Uh, let's just make one. We just need to duplicate this, guys, because we're running low on slime balls as well. So let's grab that to duplicate. What else are we going to duplicate? I think we should take white wool. I mean, it's definitely going to be worth having. I know you're probably looking at it like, well, wool is easy to get. You go kill the sheep. You do all that. But we're going to need a lot of it, guys, for the superheroes going forward. So there's no harm in just sticking a bit down. I mean, these trees are ready to go. They're rare to duplicate. I mean, it's what they want to do. So let's stick one of those in there. Let's stick a wool in there. And if that one's ready to go, do I have any cool blocks for you to duplicate? Let's see. Hmm... Uh, titanium, I suppose we could just stick that one over there. For now, because we may as well have it do something. But guys, I think this is going to look amazing. Let me mine up what we got here. Uh, no, do you know what? Let's leave it there. I want to show Scoob Steve how much it works. So, let's just leave it all there. These ones seem to be struggling. I don't know why. Okay, but either way, what we'll do is move them on out. And we can create, like I said, a really cool storage area along here. Let those duplicate. I mean, guys, picture standing here and all you can see in the whole ocean are these duplicator trees with loads of different blocks. I think that's going to look amazing. It's going to be so helpful to us. And it's just going to get um, a lot of stuff done for us. Let me just eat this up. Oh, oh, guys, we nearly forgot. And time's nearly up. We nearly forgot. Okay, girlfriends, we need lots of them. Okay, where are we going to go get them, though? I'd say it'll be easy to get girlfriends now that I'm Wolverine. I mean, come on, guys. Who doesn't want to date Wolverine? So, what I'll do is come in here, grab all of these. Don't be jealous. Um, there's just You're going to have more friends. That's all. Okay, so what we need is we'll grab a lot of diamonds as well then. Because we'll make them all stay somewhere. Where, is, where are we going to keep them? Okay, we need to move fast here. I dropped the string. Bad idea. Uh, we'll need to get them back. Mm, they're going to fight all of those lizards. Do you know what? Let's see if we can take over this pond. Scuba Steve was talking about Girlfriend Lagoon before. I think if we can get enough girlfriends back into this pond, it would be pretty funny. So, uh, it might not work straight away, though. I'm not going to be able to get enough, am I? Um, maybe I should have some faith in myself here. Maybe, now that I'm Wolverine, we can move fast and get the girlos. So, where are they? Uh, actually, we found a lot in the jungle before. In that kind of, like, lagoon, but... That was over... Okay, I know where that was. It was over the other side. Okay, do you have a letter for me? No. Thank you, though. All right. Let's head on over to the right-hand side, guys. That's where we saw a huge bunch of them. And if I can just go and give them... Oh, I've only got 16 flowers. I forgot to take more than one each. If it was one each, 16 of them would be perfect. But... Okay, even if we can get, like, three or four... Maybe... Do you know what? Guys... It's a good idea, but maybe we should save it for a different secret episode. Because I want to, like, show up with 
has so many girlfriends. Let's just go get one or two more because he won't find that suspicious. And then one day, just rock up with like 50 girlfriends. And then that's when the jealousy will really come out, guys. That's when you'll start to see it. This is a king crab versus a sea viper. I'm kind of interested in this. That's a very large crab. He's 221 health. Okay, who's going to win? King Crab looks like he's destroying the Sea Viper right now. Oh, Sea Viper, you're not getting any... Oh, Lizard, why are you getting involved? Y'all crazy? That's a big crab. Okay, just leave them at it. What am I doing here? <laughs> you get fascinated watching all these fights. I wish there were more mobs in the water. You could just watch them all go to battle. What is this? No, no, no. Oh, it's a spider. Okay. I was like, I thought that was an attack squid. I was like, I can't fight you if you're an attack squid. All right, what's going on in here, guys? Is this a chest? Don't tell me it. Imagine Scuba Steve had a secret chest. Okay, hold on. What is this? Sp <gasps> Jukebox pet! Yes! This is a dungeon! No way! Check it out! That is so... Ooh. Oh, I can't breathe. Oh, I forgot! Wolverine's not the best underwater. Jump! Okay, you're good at jumping out of water, though. All right, guys, check it out. I got a jukebox pet. Play disc, inventory, reserve, skip, utility, favorite food, redstone. Oh, that's so cool. So, yeah, guys, what we will do is we will save the girlfriends for another day because I want to really surprise Scoob Steve with that. But check it out. I can go add to my pet collection. That is amazing. That's going to be really cool. And I am very, very happy with that. So, guys, that is it for today's secret episode. If you guys did enjoy, then be sure to leave a thumbs up. We are going to be back later with a brand new episode of Crazy Craft with Scoop Steve, where we're going to go on an adventure. We're going to go to the Nightmare Dimension. Well, that's the plan. And we are going to also do a few other things. But you know how it goes with Crazy Craft. you got a plan. It never stays the same because something crazy happens. But, guys, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you soon for more. Oh, that's a waypoint. <laughs> Bye, guys.